I gotta say, though, she really hasn't shown any signs of having any ill intents for us. And if Maria trusts her, I guess I ought to trust her, too. Hello, Zoe. Oh. Never mind, then. You. ま、ていたぜよ。おお。その so I held a real halo in my hands. Not really. Is the forma always show us they're like weird bunches of geometric shapes? I can't wait to see the atarashimono. Let's see. New everything, huh? New gu- <sighs> okay, the new sub apps. Let's see what they are. Double scoop. Bonus skill. Wait a minute. I could use it, like, I can use a source twice? Yeah! What's the devil juicer? Okay, guys, like, let's, uh. You probably know this if you're have watched these videos at all but um so Alex is new to the Redux version of Strange Journey you might have guessed it by how really awkwardly and badly they shoehorned her into it I think what really makes her come off as ridiculous is that is not just the way they inserted her into it but that they inserted her into it with all of these terrible like bad Flash animation looking cutscenes. I think there were only two other ones in the whole game that were done in that style, right? There was the one where, um, it was when Zelenin met, met Mistema, and when Jimenez met, bu meant, met Bugaboo. When I speak, I still get meant and met confused. It's not a proud thing for, you know, I'm not proud of it as a writer. Okay. Let's see what Demeter's deal is. I'm assuming we're gonna fight Demeter. Because that seems to be... This one is one of those games where you fight everyone. Huh? Well, see you around, Demeter, I, I guess. Hup! 
Looks like we might actually have him this time. What happened to the Jimenez who would stop at nothing to get out of the Schwarzwelt? In a very real way, I suppose he's dead now.
What if I bring in old Quetzalcoatl? Ah, uh, damn it, it's this attack. Actually, wait a minute. No, hold on. Salvation is what we want. Hopefully it works, Quetzalcoatl. Come on, Quetzalcoatl! Brought him back in at an excellent moment. You know, in retrospect, I think I might have been too hard on Zelenin. She did the wrong thing, but she had suffered immense trauma, and Mestema manipulated her into doing what she did. Maybe if only I could do something other than watch and never speak. Maybe if I say he'd tried to reach out to her. In any way. Well, that's all behind us anyhow. How many demons have you seen lose to humans? The way I see it, maybe I... I'd like to say I did this for the Jimenez that was, rather than for the Jimenez that... Uh, that Jack... drove to that extreme. <laughs> you deserved better. But, what's done is done. Kochira Asa. Nimmu Bogaisha. Jimenez no Gekitai yo Kakunin. Katsute Nakama de Atta Mono o Taos Koto no Kurushisawa. Sassuru ni Amari Arimas. Wait a minute. If Alex can go back in time, though, couldn't we go back in time and prevent Earth from getting into the situation that would have. Yeah, wait, why didn't would you just go back? Well, I guess it would be much harder to prevent the situation that prevented the cause of Schwarzfeld to come about to begin with. それを忘れるとは言いません。あなたたちが罪と隣り合わせに生きる人間という存在である以上避けられないことなのですから。ですが、彼をこのような道にいたらしめた責任の一端は私にもあります。あなたたちと同じように私も
罪を持つ存在なのですその償いはこの任務の成功にしかありません任務の継続をお願いしますいやあ、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、なんか、And, and demon droogs. What the? There's an invisible path here, too, huh? I'll say I didn't expect it. Oh man, sorry. That could have gone south real quick. I really appreciate it. Jimenez is dead. I just finish this for him. There's no turning back now. I can't believe that crap Arthur gave us about sins or whatever. He's just some head with a solar powered lens on him, like a calculator. What's he know about sin? Since when's he had any sense of. Human emotion or anything like it. Another invisible track, huh? Where is this one gonna take me? I'm walking on air at this point, I don't even care. Why is that a giant with all the arms wearing a lock around its neck? What's that for? Is it a fashion thing? Sounds like. Because it is, you know, pretty stupid fashion thing you have going on there. Three mouths. How do, what's his internal anatomy look like? Does it have three esophagi? Sounds like. Well, maybe. Could have three esophagi, and then meet in one stomach, or might have multiple stomachs. Like a. cow. Yeah, the ancient Greeks who made this shit up probably didn't think about it either. You see, this is something I've been thinking about. Remember Jack the Ripper? How Jack the Ripper, that might not really have been the actual Jack the Ripper, and it was probably just sort of the result of this urban legend. Kind of like the Mad Gasser. Because in real life, the Mad Gasser was just a mass hysteria. So maybe it could be the reason we have all these demons that reflect all these real life religions is because people believed in them and somehow people's belief in them ended up causing these demons to manifest in whatever alternate demon dimension all of these demons are coming out of. And the angels, you know, notwithstanding that the angels are themselves demons, I suppose that the angels too are coming out of some kind of other Dimension. So is heaven another dimension? Does that mean heaven is another timeline? Is heaven the timeline where Adam and Eve didn't fall? Were Adam and Eve real then? So Maria was real, so I'd think that that means that apparently the whole Jesus thing is real, right? But like I just said, it's hard to tell because who knows how much of this stuff exists because the, it would, the demons came to Earth and showed themselves to people and so so on and so forth. And how much of this has, has come out this way? Just because people had their beliefs beliefs in these different cults. These different... These different beliefs... 
these different gods, these different religions. But I really would like to know more about, you know, their relationships. It makes you wonder. Maybe I ought to bring that level 66 guy into the battle, get some analysis of him. Welcome aboard, Ungyoki. I fused you in anticipation of killing my former comrade Jimenez. It's never a happy day when you kill your former comrades, is it? No, he didn't deserve that. But he wasn't the Jimenez he used to be no more. Anyway, he was a mercenary. How many people you think he killed? How many people I killed? I'm a soldier. Jimenez, Zelenin, what's a couple more? Especially when they're literally no longer humans and had decided to become agents operating against humanity. At least as much as the contemporary world leaders whose disastrous, self-serving, myopic policies have resulted in the Schwarzveld manifesting in the first place. Maybe that's what Alex is going to tell me. She's going to say, hey, let me tell you what went wrong. Humans, they weren't actually able to recover from things because people just went on believing in nothing. Believing in nothing but greed. And barely even that. Or rather, not barely even that. But b believing in it in the sense of they don't really even put any value in it beyond they know it's stupid. They know it's doomed, but they just don't care because they can't even conceive of anything different. It's capitalist realism, to use the late Mark Fisher's uh, term terminology. Nothing can be imagined. Nobody believes in anything anymore. No one. Here I am. Uh, fighting for humanity like this, no one believes in anything. You know, something else I just don't... I get it, the Red Sprite, we're an international team. Men and women, and maybe even other genders, from all different corners of the Earth, working together to try and stop the Schwarzveld. But at the end of the day, I, I don't know any of those people. I'm sure they have their own interesting stories, you know, Mia, Mackie, Tyler, Maibe. But what was the point of any of these characters, like from a writing standpoint? They didn't have character arcs. When we were introduced to Dent, we knew he was going to have this story arc. Story arc. We knew he was going to, to give us missions. I thought, okay, this is how they're going to flesh out all of these characters. But they didn't. They didn't flesh out any of them. Why? Why even introduce all of these names for nothing? When's the last time Mackie helped us, huh? Hell, it's it's not just not just Zelenin and Jimenez in it. It, it is it, you know. Fuck you, Mem Aleph. I killed Norris. And I as good as killed Scott back in Bodies. What even ever happened to those guys? I mean, I assume they got back, but the writing doesn't care about them. The writing doesn't care about anything. I guess I do believe in humans, though. Must I go through all this 
all this torture. Gate search, activation. Door of the exit was successful. Now this place we're in now. This is what hell looks like. It really is. It's a teleport maze. God couldn't have done better in terms of casting Lucifer and Moloch and the whole lot of those bastards into the abyss than sending them into teleport mazes. Oh. Okay, there's the teleport. I guess that also would explain how Alice came to be here. She is maybe the manifestation of this girl who really existed and was a developing serial killer. Or maybe. She exists here. Yikes. Maybe she exists here. Because, once again, there was this idea. People had these ideas of her, and so she existed. You know, maybe it wouldn't be so unreasonable to think that we could encounter Captain Ahab here after all. Nice work, Alice. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm glad she's here. How many times has she saved us, you think? Look at that thing with the stairs in the background. I bet you it was temples just like that, where monsters like Asura were worshipped back in ancient times. Oh, oh, so she's wearing a skin-tight, like, latex red vest with her hand hair holding Christmas ornaments. I don't even care anymore. What is there I haven't seen, huh? Damn it! This isn't a teleport maze, I was wrong. It's teleport traps. They're just traps, full stop. Meant to lure you in so you get sent back a few meters. This is really petty stuff, Mem Aleph. Of course, I'm petty too. This game's prepared to be cheap. I'm gonna be cheap too. I am just gonna go easy mode. When I finally get to her. Whoa! A lift! Maybe to Mem Aleph? Maybe! I mean, already to the ninth basement floor, but I wouldn't... I wouldn't... I wouldn't be too optimistic about that quite yet. Seems pretty clear to me... ...that there's no reason to be too optimistic about getting through Horologium with any degree of speed. Another lift, huh? I'm going up here because I might make a shortcut for when I need to get here from the red sprite. Or... not. I need to get a new gun. Just proven too inefficient so far. I just they don't have the strength they used to.
I don't know. Maybe it's about time I uh, figured out what I needed to what I need to get to that dwarf. I have a feeling he'd give me a good weapon. At this point, I'd prefer just to depend on Jimenez. Wait, Jimenez? Listen to me. I got Jimenez on the brain after what happened to Irving. I'll never hurt a hair on Irving's head. Level 71, huh? What level am I? 72! Hell, there are lots of fusions I can finally fucking make. Let's see, anything with you? Say, Sphinx? Who was it that would lead to Sphinx, anyway? You? Another one of the useless ones. Oh, I could make my own Christmas... ball hair woman. No thanks. You. No, it's all Arachnes. I love Arachne as, next as, as much as the next guy, but... Maybe it's a bit much to have all Arachne all the time. Still can't get Thor yet. I'm surprised Thor is aligned with Chaos. I'd think it'd be Lauki who's Chaos. Well, Lauki is. I wouldn't expect those two to get along so well. There's like no good fusions here. Lilith? Please. No. How could this be? None. What happened to all those promising combinations? Oh, I could get Fafnir. He's an upgrade to Dakini in every way. Except, of course, those stylish masks she has on her waist. What does he have on his waist? Nothing. Ah, eh, well. Dakini, I'm gonna lose a lot of useful magic. What other combinations we have with Anata here? None. Well, very well. I'd say that, uh... Yeah, it's worth... Dakini's going to be less of a loss than Rangda. See, I want to register uh, pretty much everybody, don't I? Where's Rangda? I'll register you, even though it was Dakini who's gonna get fused. Dakini? Where is she? Lady... Is she a femme? Yeah. Wait. No, whatever. I would have marked her out as more of a butch myself. Hold on, did I f mark a nata? Yeah, I did. Or I did not. Yeah, I didn't. Let's see what abilities are we going to be use losing. I'm Rita. That is a loss. Uh. Well, you're already going to resist physical, but he might just inherit it. I don't know. Frolic. Arguably a loss. Yeah, we're going to lose two people with Frolic. Might be worth trying to preserve that. A potent, heady brew. See, you have some kind of heart tube there. These demons, they don't make the least lick of sense. Heart tube. Let's see, where is he? There he is. Actually, Kretzel Coddle, useful as he is, any fusions we can make with him to be any good? No, not particularly. Well, I, no, no, here we go. Susano, Vitra. Those look pretty tough. Those guys do. Maybe I have to go get Vishnu again, see what I can make out of him. I think we have a linking point.
Look at these weird stone towers. I shouldn't call them towers, they look like mesas or something. So peculiar are the ground we're rocking on here. It's clearly not quite level. But it is, uh... It's laid out in a remarkably regular grid-like pattern. I don't think I'll be able to recruit this guy this way. Okay, let's test you out, Fafnir. This guy's tough. Oh, his music. It is so old. I am so sick of this music. Isn't it so exciting? The menu navigation. Well, I'll scan him later. I'm just wandering randomly at this point. There I was, it, on the ninth floor, and I just left it. Oh well, walking this way, I'm probably gonna get somewhere sooner or later. Is that lava? Couldn't be. I couldn't walk this close to it, even in a demonica if it was. What the hell? I'm gonna touch whatever that is, and it'll be like in the opening of Raiders of the Lost Ark with a damn boulder. Oh, it's a switch. Maybe it'll turn off all those doors. One way to find out. Think I could, uh, convince this tyrant to join up? Oh, they're strobe light Christmas ornaments. I guess that answers that question. Yeah, weak to ice, maybe. No such luck. Fafnir is not to be trifled with. Neither is Alice. Wasn't Fafnir a dragon that died in that myth? Well, clearly he doesn't have much in common with his mythological counterpart. For one thing, he's a robot? I guess not, I don't know. What do I know about the myth of Fafnir? I'm just some soldier. Maybe it's like Leviathan, whose scales are said to be like shields and so close together and yada yada yada. In the Book of Job. Leviathan's always turning up in a Final Fantasy. Maybe Final Fantasy is just another one of the many parallel universes that constitute Megami Tensei. No, didn't do squat for these doors. Must be there's another switch like that to press somewhere. Maybe over there. Who knows? The Schwarzwelt is so weird. Right now, we're deep, deep beneath the surface of places we were before, but look around us. It looks like there's nothing but sky. 
Like as we've been going down, we've actually been moving back up towards the atmosphere. <laughs> Keep the maca flowing. Anything over here? No? Probably not. There's not. Very... Was it really odd? Everything in the Schwarzveld is, uh, is laid out against us. You could say it's optimized against us. Whatever happened to Ryan? Now that Zelenin's dead, are those guys just... Is the spell gonna wear off? Are they gonna... I, I don't know. Did the angels just come and take him? I don't really care at this point. Get out of the Schwarzveld save Earth. It's all we're here for. And it sure sounds simple, but no, we're not going to get to that main chamber. Between us and it is uh, some fluid we're not going to go into. Looks like that kind of acid they have on planet Zebes. 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 We're just sort of teasingly close to it. Huh. Guess there's still more around here I haven't looked into yet. Guess I recruit, could re try to recruit you again. Maybe you'd be good for another fusion. Typical. Like, just try and go a few steps and they just erect new barriers to keep you from progressing. That's the human condition for you. Oh! Rare forma, huh? Wasn't expecting that. Come to think of it, I think the uh, forma you need to see in the dark is on basement floor six. We're gonna have to head back there in a minute. Whatever. Nothing, huh? Typical, isn't it? Nothing. It's not that there's nothing that's typical. It's more that things that are typical... Nothing is typical. Nothing... There are a lot of typical things, and one of those things that is typical is nothing. Finding nothing, being nothing, amounting to nothing. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust.
It might be true on an individual level, but will we let it be true on a species-wide level? I don't want humans to go extinct this way. The Schwarzveld way. Humans should go extinct because... the humans that are left probably somewhere very far away have evolved into something else. Oh, but that's millions and millions of years down the line. Maybe that's just too long for our little mammal brains to worry about. Rangda knows what I'm talking about. Living for millions of years. She just doesn't seem to mind it, though. That's the thing. Okay, how are we going to get back? Oh, we've already gone completely the wrong way to head back downstairs. Tyrant Cert. His head's tall. Another one of the switches. Who knows what it'll do? I'm not pressing it, I appear to be twisting it. You want- you're telling me those doors were just magma blocking the way? No, they weren't. Those were thick doors that were rising out of the ground. It wasn't just magma. And again, who knows? This thing- the demonica displays things, oddly. Bye, Cracky. Guess what's he gonna say by God? Demons don't swear by God. I don't even know if he swears by Lucifer. Get your soul eaten, they said. They've repeatedly indicated souls exist. At this point, I figure I'm damned. How am I ever going to be able to... I guess that's the thing. I d if I, uh, once I die, I'm just gonna go to hell. Will this all have been worth it then? I don't know. Hope there's some good fusion I'm gonna get out of this. That's the only reason I'm doing it. I'm banking on a fusion. Wonder which one of the heads is talking, speaking of multiple esophagi. No. There's not a good fusion. Okay, let's see what's over this way. Still haven't found the form I've been searching for. What about something this way? I figure this path is leading somewhere. Let's go. It's not even worth dealing with them at this point. They're just sera- it's just a seraph. Okay, what am I looking for? What's he called? Uh, yeah, uh, Ho Niao. How do I get rid of this guy? There's just not a good option, is there? What about Lilith? Here we go, Scotty, that's something. 
But is it really worth losing Rangda? That's the question. Let's look at their abilities. She's definitely a physical attacker. I'm not convinced she's a substantial improvement from Lilith. Who cares at this point? Walking along a big cliff, huh? Didn't form by any normal geological forces like we'd understand on Earth. But I'm not a geologist, I'm here to kill Mim Aleph. And that's all. Yeah, come aboard. She has such nice jewelry. I realize that those uh, bracelets are... They're not on her. I guess those are bracelets on her upper arms. They match the red bead trim of her red... or her green top. Anyway, we might have a more reasonable fusion here. Come to think of it, I can finally summon you, Norn. What can you do? You have Laplace Curse, powerful wind magic, and Amrita. Problem is, you're not going to really even have the most basic of physical attacks, are you? You're only inheriting anything from Atropos, eh? Certainly looks that way. Let's give you something else to balance you out. Actually, this is a chance to see if I do can double up on these now, so do I still have a Moloch source? Where will it be is the problem. I'm not sure where it was in this hierarchy. Yeah, I think I don't have it anymore. Look at all these demons I've gone through used like just objects. Sure, let's bring her in. She helped us out a long time ago. I guess she's just these three sisters put together, huh? Demons do have many forms. And she talks this way because the scriptwriters couldn't even have been bothered to have her remember us like Zeus. Oh, now I have Norn and Yggdrasil in the party. How ironic. Let me guess. This is the path to Mem Aleph. Well, not directly. A throne. Flames of Hell, huh? Unlock. Hatsudou. What? Am I gonna meet Mastema? 
wow, this is one big room. Oh, great. At least there's a good door ahead. Let's just try her physical attack, even though it won't really get an idea of it from this, since he's strong against physical attacks. Yggdra Source. That brings back some memories. Oh, a door, huh? Can't get to it from this side. I guess these invisible walls are the flames of hell that uh, the throne promised. Can I go around the room? Nah. Probably can, honestly. Who cares? Hold on, I never found the damn forma that let me see in the dark spaces. Might be too late to even need it at this point. Oh, wait a minute. But I guess I'll go back and see if I can uncover the thing. No dignity for me at all ramming into these walls face first like a clown. I think I found it. About time. Wish I just got this before I had to, or before I chose to, for some reason, sweep out the womb of grief. Okay, Irving. I really brought you something this time. You guys have any comments about our old friend Jimenez? <sighs> First Selen and now Jimenez. They may have turned on us, but it's still hard having to fight our old friends. But we can't let it get to us. We have Plan Omega to consider. Let's go on with the mission. I think it's the best way to honor all the Red Sprite's crewmen. I agree. Thinking about it, I feel like Jimenez was the most attached to life of the team. When you value your own life that highly, you can't hesitate to kill for it. He stayed true to that. But those who live by the sword, well, you know. I wonder if he realized all the implications of his philosophy as he died. That's a very odd thing to say, frankly. Hello, Zoe. Implications of his philosophy. What philosophy? He cared about no one but himself and Bugaboo for some reason. You bet I do. わしの目は誤魔化せんぞ。さあ、素直にそれを渡すぜよ。オッケー。挑戦の時間だ。わしは科学でもって何度でも宇宙の真理に挑むぜよ。チェン、しっかりついてこいよ。Thank you, Lazy. Alvin, 
頼むぜよまずはそうぜよ次にいい選択ぜよはあありがとうございますコーヒーブレイクぜよ They say so much nonsense as they work. The burning souls of the two scientists developed a new app. Yosh, Onoshi no demonica o chick to kariru ze yo. Might be the last time we do this, Irving. Oh, just about. Money or your nonsense phrases came true. Nonzio Gokuro Datana. It's more Gomena Saine. They're so apologetic, as if I don't already love them. Tokini Ome Madamada Jotona Formo Kakshimo Tordaro. Really, buddy? You're gonna say all of this exactly the same? I guess you've done it all these other times. Him and Chen have a routine going. They're not just scientists, they're stand up comics. You two do some science to it. Ching! Shikari tsuite go yo! Thank you, Lizzie. Avin, let's see you next time. It's more gomen na sai ne. Skoshi jikan o chodai. I've I have all the time in the world, Chen, for you and Irving, of course. まずはそうぜよ。次に。いい選択ぜよ。ありがとうございます。コーヒーブレイクぜよ。The burning souls of the two scientists developed a new app! Yosh! Onoshino Demonica o chick to kariru ze yo! This time it really might be the last time we do this. Aate! Kohi break ze yo! Just thinking about how far we've come together. It's no problem, Chen. You. I know you have, buddy. As you can see, I've brought dozens. I pour them out on the floor and it makes this pretty glass clinking sound. It's kind of sad to think that at, it's not it's not going to be that much longer before when we back on Earth, Chen and Irving can be with their friends and families again. I'll probably keep up a correspondence. Of course, we're gonna have to figure out some way to shut down the demon summoning program. Or we could use the demons to... No, no. If we try to use violence to usher in a new world order... Well, that's not, we have to use violence if we're going to do this, actually. The key thing is that our violence does not end up reproducing hierarchy, hierarchical social structures similar to those that we aim to replace. 
that unlike here in the Schwarzwald, where we've just repeated the cycle of consumption and destruction that ravaged Earth, we need to not repeat that cycle when we get back to Earth. <laughs>